lakes. There's no lakes under the truck. You can even come over here too. There's no lakes under the truck. Driven Bell alternator. It's probably meant to secure. Not quite been broken. All wires connected. The bell is not cracked or frayed. The free place between half and three fourths of an inch. Passing inside general hoses. Properly mounted secure at both ends. No abrasions, but just a cut. Not leaking. Now we go to the driver's side. So driver's side general hoses. Anything you see holes. Properly mounted secure at both ends. No abrasions, but just a cut. Not leaking. Cooling level. It's properly mounted secure. Not grabbing or broken. It's not leaking and it's filled up to the manufacturer specification. Driven bell water pump. This one. Proper driven bell water pump. That's the bell and this is the water pump. It's properly mounted secure, not grabbing or broken. It's not leaking. The bell is not cracked or fray. In the free place between half and three fourths of an inch. Oil level. It's filled up to the manufacturer specification. Uh, power steering fluid. Proper mounted secure, not cracking or broken, it's not leaking, it's filled up to the manufacturer specification. Gear driven power steering pump, just point over there, down there. It's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken, it's not leaking. Keep pointing over there. Gear driven air compressor, it's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken, it's not leaking. A steering gear box and holes. Steering gearbox and holes. It's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. No bridges, but just the cuts above ends. It's not leaking. Steering linkage. One, two, and three. There's three of them. One, two, and three. Steering linkage. Properly, properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. There's no nuts. Two and three. A cutter pins missing. Spring handles and mounts from and rear over there. Scrapping matter secure, not grabbing or broken. Leaf springs. This piece. All the way from here to back there. Scrapping matter secure, above ends, front and rear. Not grabbing or broken, not not shifted. U-bolts. It's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. None are missing. Chuck absorber. It's properly mounted secure above end. Not cracking or broken. It's not leaking. Brake holes in line. Properly mounted secure. No bridges. Boy just a cut. It's not leaking air. Brake chamber. It's properly mounted secure. Not cracking or broken. It's not leaking air. A slack adjuster and push rod. It's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. With the brake release and pull by the hand, the push rod should remove more than one inch. Should not move more than one inch. Brake drum. This big metal out here. It's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. Brake lining is the pedal right there inside. Proper amount of secure, not cracking or broken. There's no oil or debris. It's not dangerous, one thing. Now we go to the outside. Axle hub. Axle hub or seal. This is a hub. But you can say axle hub or seal. Proper amount of secure, not cracking or broken. It's not leaking. It's filled up to the manifest specification. Lock nuts. Proper amount of secure, not cracking or broken. None are missing, there's no crack or rust or powder residue around the ball holes. Nuts, nuts holes, ball holes. Rims, it's properly mounted secure, not cracking or broken. There's no notarized welds. Steel tire, it's properly mounted secure, no bridges, but just a cut to the sidewall or the tread. And the tread depth is no less than 432 of an inch. And it's filled up to the minus five specification by checking it with tire gauge and that's the engine compartment 